All right, we are back with another episode of Guild Wars, and we are joined with the special guest, the man, the myth, the legend himself. Guild Wars in 2024 goes by Mod. Uh, if you have not followed him already, definitely do so. He is, he is putting out quality Guild Wars content and just playing like uh actually i'm trying to multitask here all right this is trying to getting the uh discord to work and i don't know whose problem it was mine my system or his system could not get the voice to work uh maybe in a future episode we can do that but anyway he's joining us for the sanctum k mission uh I'll be narrating and typing to him. Should be should still be fun. Uh, this mission is a pretty sweet mission. It is one that is a uh, uh, kind of the turning point in the prophecies campaign, and that it's basically going to take us to a whole new continent. What I remember. Oh, it looks like he's running a. Melee pet build. <laughs> I love the uh, the pet that he's got going on. <laughs> wow, they are just they are just getting melted. Getting melted. Sick. Maybe he's run. It looks like he's running the anniversary sword. That's uh, any sword? If so, that's pretty sweet. I think the the ranger anniversary sword for the ranger is the anniversary sword for the ranger is uh, anniversary weapon for the ranger is a sword. Yeah, in this mission we have the Scepter of Ore that we stole from the White Mantle in the previous mission, and we are taking it to Vizier Kilbron. And he is going to help us get off of this continent. Unlock some power that will help us challenge the White Mantle. I think we need isn't the bonus up this way? Okay. <laughs> okay, sweet. Yeah, we both forget old mission. I think we need to take some... Yeah, okay. I remember we need to take this restless spirit to his resting point. But he only follows us if we have the scepter. I think. Got a. Or. Whoops. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. Uh, freaking out of here. Ooh. The typing. Why is typing? Super aggro. I be. All right. Lightning Drakes. Didn't realize there's so many. But yeah, we need to take this scepter to Vizier Kill Bron, but in order to do in order to do the bonus, we need to do we need to keep the scepter first. 
try and make sure that happens. Oops, I'm casting out of order here. My casting time agility is really fast. I couldn't get the deep wound. AoE the Dimic off. So we need to do bonus or talking to the here. Let this ghost. Nice. Yeah, I wish we could have gotten the Discord to work, but probably something on my end, I'm guessing. I did update it, so I probably I probably should have restarted my. Okay, that was a practice run. It. Right, and we're cooking now. Oh, why did the? Oh, this. Ability. There we go. I don't know. Maybe, um, Deep Boon doesn't work on the undead. I'm not sure. Light setback. <laughs> uh, this is the way I think. Oh, he's he popped a birthday cupcake. I'll do it too. Good call, good call. Hopefully birth cake does the cupcake buff go away and death. That I plan on that. How come sometimes the deep wound only lasts for like a second? There's, I mean, he's an elementalist. He doesn't have a, a way to remove. Here.
All right, I'm liking this pace. Coming up on this. Go ahead and keep it in. Whoops. I fingered my three button. Nice. Having another human player for sure. Alright, so we're fighting Ma White Mantle and the Undead in this mission. <laughs> nice interrupt. Whoa, that was a lot of numbers. Oh, right, they have Frenzy, so it does double damage. Dang, that was hot. We're stuck on that chest. <laughs> Never seen that before. I guess I should just keep the keep the uh, scepter because it um gives me that plus one. Go. Don't remember dragons. I don't remember fighting dragons here. I don't think there's... Yes, it is. Where 
Where's Alicia? Let's flame her. Like the old days. Doing. Necromancer also kind of kills himself. Lost Claude, that's it. Really, I'm not sure how to do the yeah, bonus. Okay, here's Vizier. That's the bonus. Need to get. Sure, if. Oh. Easier. Now we lose the bonus. Already holding that to like a sight for sore eyes, one of the greatest treasures of my now ruined home. But while being reunited with the scepter of or should be a cause for celebration, the events of today have saddened my heart. There is a traitor in your midst. 
one of the Shining Blade's own inner council. What? Who? I believe you know him by the name Marcus. He masquerades as your friend and confidant. Marcus. But he is instead a white mantle infiltrator. Ah, so he's the reason the mantle knew about the Henge of Denravi. Yes, and he has sold you out again. There are white mantle all over this island. They come now for the scepter as we speak. We must get to the dock and warn Avenia. I'm afraid our tale grows darker still. The mantle have already stormed our ship. It lies broken at the bottom of the harbor. Our friend Avenia has already been taken prisoner. Uh -oh. Avenia's been taken? That also means we're trapped here. That boat was our only way off Sanctum K. Do not lose hope yet, my friend. I can summon from the deep a ship that can carry us from this place. Make for the beach. Meet me at the dock and I will perform the necessary ritual. There must be half of the White Mantle army between us and the beach. Then you will need some help. Do not fear the walking dead. Through the center oh, they obey my the commands. Cool lines. Hurry now. Looks like we the TV show time. stole that line from mission. Yeah, <laughs> bonus death. I have my weapons back. We're fighting full on just to, just the cars. Man, these guys take a lot of damage. Nice. 11. We got level 18. Lost all the uh, dead there. Oh my gosh. Oh, just eyes. Ass. Ouch. Uh. 
Okay. Welcome back. <laughs> Every battle. Um. Syrian heat hurts. Right way. Remember this, we have to like defend him while he Raising a boat, carrying the boat. Super out of the way. That searing key, but it looked like that interrupt. this to hold out really I'm not sure how to do the bonus because I think the only way to get over here is if you give the scepter to the busier really don't remember I'm gonna have to make a separate playlist of just going back and doing bonuses. She resurrects. Wow. Take her out. Come on. Eesh. Eh. 
And that should do it. I think we did it. That's it, right? Oh. Oh. Thought that was it. Yeah. It's the boat. All right. On the boat. Hurry. Made it. We must make our escape. Good. <laughs> These boats can be the same boats, I think, uh, can be found in Guild Wars 2 at the bottom of the ocean. And, um, you can find them. They kept the same, like, architecture of them, too, I think. Councilor Marcus has sold you out. The mainland is no longer safe for you. Why do you, you sound like Dracula? And warn the others. I'm afraid it's too late for that. The Shining Blade have already been broken over the knee of the White Mantle. By now, those who are not already dead are fleeing into the Shiver Peaks. Then we go to the Shiver Peaks. A noble gesture, but throwing your lives away against a foe who you cannot beat will not help your friends. Then the White Mantle have won. All is lost. Do not be so sure. There is still a way to beat the White Mantle. Venture to the Crystal Desert and ascend. Only then will you be powerful enough to take on the rest of the White Mantle and their unseen gods. What must we do? Find the Prophet and claim the gift of true sight. What? That's right. You are all chosen. And now you must venture through the desert. Prove yourselves worthy and claim your birthright. Then you will take Easy. this fight to them. Prepare yourselves. The trials of ascension await. Nice. Didn't get the bonus again. That's that's uh we're getting used to that though. The Omnoon Oasis. Peace. You do. I'm gonna say sorry, couldn't get Yeah. Let me try. We're gonna go to Augury Rock next. Amnon Oasis is kind of the capital of the desert, but Augury Rock is kind of where all the magic happens, the ascension happens. We're gonna go ahead and finish this episode by going to Augury. It looks like we get some new henchmen here. We got Lena finally. Lena coin. Finally, a second monk. Much easier now. Um, has. Girl, no. Question. Ghostly hero. Hi. You are the chosen. I look at Augury Rock 500 experience. 500. Primary.
There seems like a primary. Here, we're gonna pick it up anyway. Here, they forgot to put it. The primary quest. Huh? Onward. All right, we're heading to Augury Rock. Next. One thing I'm really excited for is finishing the desert because then we can actually get, what do you call them, uh, lead skills. Get deep wounds on all these guys. Not too bad, just necromancer touchers and some ranger. I think we, we got through worse. We went through worse to get here. Ah, uh, perhaps or not. Healers, man, makes a huge difference. Did I not bring her? Should be okay. Not sure how that happened because I, I guess I just double clicked on her, didn't actually send her to or add her to the team. Okay. Oh yeah. So close to our shield. There was a lot of AoE damage there for a second. Very nice. <laughs> His pet's name is so funny. Something's really hurting, doing a lot of damage to the whole team. Oh, I could have sworn that said birthday cupcake, and I looked again and said bleached carapace.
Gustav is a silent duper. I should be using Fired Hex, Hex Breaker. What am I doing? A little bit of self healing there for health. For Nice way to waste time. Devs were just like, hmm, let's slow them down a little bit. there. I can't remember if it was blind a guaranteed miss or is it just like a 80% chance or 70% seems like it's always oh, caught he linked his skills oh he's using an elite what's he running disrupting nice Always good to fit in a pet build, Ranger. After ascending, you can just automatically change to all the secondary classes, or if you have to um, request for each one. Bing. 
Hey, we're crippled and limping all the way to there. Ever. that oh nice Got the throughout to arrows. Hey, level twenty two, man. Crazy. Couple mobs up front. Level twelve for his pet. In the desert, I remember feeling the uh, like the first time I played this, the desert content just seemed like such a huge difficult leap. Crazy how helpless they make you feel in the desert. Enemies popping up everywhere, getting wiped all the time. Not so bad this time, especially with a human player. I believe I forgot to bring that. I don't know how that- I still don't know how that happened. I failed to bring that other healer. But we're doing alright. I mean, if we brought the other healer, we'd be doing a lot less damage. Than something. Ooh, red die. Oh. Boots. I think this guy gives max damage. Oh no. What's oh, max armor gloves? I think that isn't. Minotaur horn. Nice. Okay. Augury rock. Ten Minotaur. Oh, just ten Minotaurs. We got get some skills. I didn't know we get skill missions this late into the game. Was he here?
Hit me. Never. All right, we have finished uh, a pretty nice run from, uh, where was it? Sanctum K all the way to the desert in Augury Rock. Very nice chapter. Just closed and opened. Um, yeah, this was, I remember back in the day, this was a huge turning point. And very happy to get this far. Thanks for joining me the whole way through. I'm going to be editing this a lot. So it's, we're at 49 minutes here. But after I edit it, hopefully it'll be a little shorter. I want to, I don't want to try and, I don't want to put too many episodes longer than an hour. So anyway, with that, we will end here. And until next time, we'll be taking on desert missions. Catch you later. Peace.